Taking a high-speed ferry in Greece, for instance, with sea jets, then watch this, because this is how it goes. Check-in opens 48 hours before your ferry, which is very easy to find if you book through the Ferry Hopper app, where you can also live-track your ferry so that you are not too early in case of a delay, because in port you will be waiting until your ferry arrives and all previous passengers have disembarked. Always double-check the name of your ferry before you make your way onto it via the car or food passenger's bridge. At check-in, you will download your e-ticket, which will then be scanned. You leave your larger luggage pieces on the car deck. As on the plane, there's simply no Room for all this luggage in the cabin. You may then enter the cabin and find your seat, which has been assigned to you during booking or check-in. These are the regular seats. If you're lucky, you have a table. These are business seats, exactly the same, just less crowded. And here on the right, we see the platinum seats, which on some CGS ferries are in a separate lounge with bar. Some ferries offer Wi-Fi if you get a ticket from the accounting office. All ferries have clean public toilets and a bar to get snacks and drinks from. Ten minutes before arrival, you will hear an announcement to go downstairs, pick up your luggage, and be ready for disembarkation. Side note, if you get seasick easily, avoid the high-speed ferries as they get bumpy in rough weather. Check the playlist for more ferry travel videos and follow for daily Greece travel tips.